Hey Parasites and welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog and I am out she outside where they're filming Venom 2 right now. Hey, what's up, Parasites? Welcome to episode 875 of the Venom Vlog. Thank you so much for being here. We are getting near the end of this show. We are probably 25, maybe 30. I might go a little bit past 900. It might not be an even cutoff, but we're getting near the end of this show, and I really just want to thank all of you guys for being on this ride with us for the past six years. Actually, coming up in November, it will be six years exactly, and we've done almost 900 episodes. That's about 300 episodes a year. That's, uh, that's wild to think about. So thank you guys again. Um, I want to talk about this thing that happened last week in New York where Tom Hardy was walking around in New York, and they were doing pickup shots for Venom The Last Dance. And I know some people are like, no, it was reshoots, blah, blah, blah. Trust me, I heard it from the most reliable source that you can hear it from that these are not reshoots, that this is not a scene that they're reshooting, that this was always planned to be picked up later because, you know, who knows, maybe people speculate over stuff. And surprisingly, I haven't seen a lot of chatter or speculation over this. I mean, think about it. Venom, Eddie Brock, is walking around New York City, which he has not done in any of the movies. He said he was from New York and he got kicked out of New York, basically run out of there in the first film but he's never set foot back in New York in any of the films. And it looks like he is now. And this could be something that, you know, who knows where it happens in the movie, but it looks like Eddie Brock going home. He looks cleaned up and stuff. He's wearing like a t-shirt and jeans. So he just looks kind of cleaned up and everything. And I'm like, well, that's cool. Like maybe this is something that we can speculate where it might happen in the film. And, uh, and if he'll see anyone, you know, like it's New York, like, you know, does his world have a Spider-Man in it? You know, I know a lot of people really want Andrew Garfield and, you know, they want to see this version of Eddie, you know, meet him. I mean, there's so many things that people could be speculating on and I haven't seen anyone do it, uh, which is pretty surprising to me. So if you have seen other people out there talking about this, you know, let me know in the comments for sure. But in the small research that I've done, a couple hours looking around, seeing if other people were talking about and making a big deal out of Venom being in New York for this film, no one has. Uh, but they called it reshoots. I've seen that, but these are not reshoots. This is not a scene that was already done that they're doing again. Like I said earlier, this is something that they're adding, that they're picking up, that they had scheduled and they couldn't do at a certain time and can do now. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. You know, I'm starting to think a lot about what it could be. And what was really cool, though, was Buster Rhymes was in New York at the same time. And I saw on his Instagram that he went and met Tom Hardy. And obviously fans did, too. There's a lot of people out there posting pictures of meeting Tom in New York and photos of him and everything. So big shout out to all of you who got to meet him. He's a great guy. And Buster Rhymes meeting with him and Czarface and all these other people that got to hang out with him and train with him when he went training. It's really cool. He's a really great guy, as we know. We met him a couple times, and he's just so awesome to people. And it's cool to see that continuing and just his love for this project and uh, and just having fun and walking around New York, like I said, just awesome. And uh, Busta Rhymes possibly doing something for the soundtrack. He posted like a little snippet on his Instagram as well where his face kind of turned into a Venom face. And so I'm like, all right, so maybe we'll get a Busta Rhymes song for the new movie instead of Eminem. I'm totally down for that. I love Busta Rhymes. He was touring here recently with Missy Elliott in Orlando and then bouncing around the globe. And I think even up in New York and big fan of both of them so I was uh you know would have loved to seen him but you know trying to juggle life and a concert and everything with us is really hard right now with all the fronting and switching and alters and stuff so so we couldn't do anything that fun or that intense to our senses but uh but it was still cool to see that he was there and he walked on the set and met Tom and that there might be a soundtrack thing coming from Busta Rhymes for Venom 3 so we'll see you know time will tell with all that but for now let me know what you think you know this whole thing with him walking around New York do you think it's nothing? Do you think it's just like a, a thing they're adding to the end of the movie where he's just finally back home? Maybe he doesn't have the symbiote anymore. And he's like, okay. And it's like a happy ending for this version of Eddie. Maybe he sees Anne, you know, or whatever. Like, who knows? It could be anything and everything at the same time. I want to hear your thoughts. Let me know down below. And as always, we'll have some fun speculation down there. Thanks for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will have some Venom symbiote short reviews for the Venom War comic book posting up on our shorts. So be sure to check those out. They're going to post up every week when new issues drop. Thanks so much. See you later. Peace.